Elon Musk's Tesla has finally deployed a small group of self-driving taxis, picking up paying passengers across Austin, Texas yesterday. The event marked the first time Teslas without drivers have carried riders as a paid service. A venture owner, Elon Musk, is says it's crucial to the EV maker's financial success. Despite some concern over the safety of the model, Musk said Tesla would be, quote, super paranoid. Tessa Bennett joins us in studio with more on the launch. Tessa, what are some of the main takeaways from yesterday's event? Manisa, Musk says this project is a culmination of a decade of hard work, noting the AI chip and software teams used in the vehicles were built from scratch within Tesla. Ten driverless cars were deployed, and each ride cost customers a flat rate of $4.20. First Tesla robo taxi ride. Tesla's long-awaited robo-taxis hit the streets of Austin, Texas yesterday, transporting paying customers around. In videos shared by the company on social media, a small group of invited guests and shareholders were seen trying out the new service. Tesla's owner, tech billionaire, and former member of the Trump administration, Elon Musk, congratulated his team after the launch event, saying this rollout was the culmination of a decade of hard work. Tesla calls it full self-driving, but it's not quite fully yet, but they're working on FSD. In normal FSD, there's a driver behind the steering wheel, and that driver watches the car drive and intervenes if it's needed. What we saw on Sunday was that driver moved from the front seat of the car to a remote control room complete with steering wheels. There's also a person physically present in the passenger seat. The launch event was talked up by Musk, who's riding much of the company's future financial success on this new service, but some were left wanting more. Once the cars hit the road, the first thing we noticed was these were not the cars that Elon Musk promised us. These are not the two seat cyber cabs that are completely autonomous with no steering wheels, no control whatsoever. They are modified model Ys uh, that have updated software as well as a safety monitor sitting in the seat to, ready to take over in case something happens. One passenger of the robo taxi launch wrote online they participated in 11 rides with the service and noted there were zero issues. But another reported one of the vehicles briefly drove on the wrong side of the street. And an author who has been critical of Tesla in the past shared a video of a robo taxi breaking hard in the middle of traffic in response to stationary police vehicles outside the vehicle's path of movement. One of the biggest safety concerns comes from the company's decision to use only camera-based technology to operate, rather than relying on the use of radar or ultrasonic sensors. It's not the case the robot taxi has to know it's in trouble. Rather, the remote human safety driver has to jump in if something goes wrong. And so you don't have the risk of the robot taxi being confused and not calling for help. But what you do have is what if that cell phone data link drops in the middle of driving and something is in the middle of going wrong. As the rollout date of Tesla's robo-taxis approached, Texas lawmakers worked to enact new rules around autonomous vehicles. The state's governor, a Republican, signed legislation last Friday requiring a state permit to operate the self-driving models and will take effect September 1st. And it seems the Democrats in Texas agree with the need for caution. We want to make sure that our community is as safe as possible when they launch the new Robo taxis. If this trial is successful, industry experts say Tesla still faces a long road towards delivering on some of Musk's promises. In fairness to Tesla, they're not the only company that's had difficulty on this autonomy road. Uh, companies like GM has scaled back their efforts uh, due to the expense, the difficulty with the technology. This is not indicative of where the technology is going to go, and certainly this doesn't qualify as a reasonable pilot that encompasses all all potential use cases, all potential scenarios. Despite the mixed reviews from yesterday's launch, Tesla shares jumped by a significant margin today. If those gains hold, the company will add nearly $100 billion to its market value.